And here are the fixed paint lines. So now the row squadron or red marking, racing stripe, whatever you want to call it, looks uh, correct now. That's uh, perpendicular with the, the ground instead of the top. So the gray gets bigger from right to left from the side. So yeah, that's this. This is this is done. This is ready to go in inside now that it's been out here drying enough. I do need to uh well that one's tight but it's a little more looser. Let's this one. So need to screw those in place, but you can do that inside real quick. The uh the dash and instrument panel is inside getting uh, prepped for the final layer of paint. It'll be the black paneling shapes over the... There's my uh, heater kicking on. Um, so the, the dash slash front panel is inside now getting uh, masking tape on it. So it'll have the patterns ready to spray paint for the uh, there's some geometric shapes, triangles, and odd angles for the, uh, the front panel. Um, you should just Google extreme cockpit, this is what I'm talking about, or just wait for the next video and see what it looks like. Um, so once that's done, that's the last, last piece that gets painted. And it's all goes inside, and the buttons all get installed. Uh, that's all easy, that's just drop in and no real Instructing to do is just plug and play from that point. So exciting. I don't see the other side from here. Let's see where I added some gr lighter gray.